gentlemen, it's the star of our show, Tommy Trooper. Oh, look at that. Ten years. Ten years slaving over a hot pen. Ten years. Oh, very good, brother. Ah, but the I before the E, except after C. <laughs> People picking on me. <laughs> oh, oh, what a relief. <laughs> How's that? All right. Oh. People do pick on you, don't they? All the time. And my wife picks on me. I mean, she said to me, You never take me out. So I said, All right, get ready. So she goes upstairs about five, and about ten o'clock I get worried. <laughs> I hadn't heard from her. So I go upstairs in the bedroom, and she's walking about with nothing on but a pair of football boots. <laughs> and she said, I've got nothing to wear. And I said, all right. So I went in the next night, I said, and she takes hours to get ready. Hours. Oh, dear, oh, dear. And I said, I've got two tickets to see the king and I. She said, I won't be ready. I said, it's all right, it's tomorrow night. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. <coughs> it's like a fellow, everybody picks on Peter. A fellow went into a pub, a little fellow, about five foot. Like about James Cagney. OK. <clears throat> That was good, wasn't it? <laughs> I do a lot of impressions, a lot of them. <clears throat> I do this. Is a quick one. Before I do that, listen to this. You're the first. No, you're the first to hear this. Very first. Hello, Tommy. How are you? What do you think? <laughs> now be honest. What do you think? <laughs> what? <Rubbish>. Great. <laughs> Thank you. You don't know who it is, do you? He's my milkman. <laughs> I'll give you another one, another quick one. You heard of that wonderful film star, Gregory, Gregory Peck? No, Gregory Peck. <clears throat> I've had my nose fixed and my teeth don't work. <laughs> Gregory Peck, I'd like to give my impression now of Gregory Peck's father. Hello, son. <laughs> You know, my feet are killing me. You know, every night when I'm lay, lying in bed, they get me around the throat like that. And they try to strangle me. <laughs> you can see the toe of my savior, look. And I'm lying in bed one night, and I was just like that, lying like that, like you do. And I thought to myself, I don't like this. <laughs> you do, don't you? So I thought, I'd go over the other side. So I went over like that. <laughs> and I'm like that. And I thought to myself, I think the other side's better. <laughs> so I went back again. <laughs> and my wife had just rolled up her hair and put it under the bed. <laughs> 
And then she said to me, the front door's bolted. I said, well, I can't get far, can it? <laughs> I'll get it in the pond. Here's another joke. Two, two Chinamen, see? And they're talking, you're like this. They're like, you're like this. Uh, two Chinamen talking to each other. One says, Ik Wang Gan Dong. To Hong Wing Tang Tong Tong. Tang Tang to Ping Bang Bong Tang. Oh, this is funny, isn't it? <laughs> And the other one said, Tong Tong Wang, Ping Tong Fong, Boom Tong Tang. I thought you'd like it, I do. <laughs> now, these rings will drop apart in front of your very eyes. And now, a bullfinch. <laughs> oh. They would draw apart in front of the first My name's Mr. Fitting. I come here for a Cooper. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, sir. No, no. The other way round. <clears throat> oh, all right. My name's Mr. Fitting. I come here for a Cooper. <laughs> yes, Mr. Cooper. <coughs> You're here for your fitting, yes? Yes. I thought so. Just one moment. Ah, here we are. <laughs> Large pinhead. <laughs> Little wobbly chops. <laughs> The suit, sir, the suit. It's a pinhead. Oh, I see. I see, of course, yes, of course, yes. Shall we slip into the jacket? <coughs> Can both of those get in it? <laughs> All right. Woof! Hold that. Allow me, sir. Thank you very much. Thank you. Now, here we go. Now, gently, 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 gently. Please, sir. After all, sir does appear to have rather fat shoulders. How can you have fat shoulders? It's only tact. Well, that's tact. What do you like when you're rude? <laughs> Would you care to look into the mirror? Certainly. I've vanished! <laughs> I've disappeared! <laughs> oh! I'm overdoing this. The other side. <laughs> I've vanished. Well, the other side. Oh, the other side, sir. <laughs> well, it's not bad as me, isn't it? Very really nice. But I thought the buttons would come with the price of the suit. <laughs> sir, this is only a first fitting. You get your buttons. All right, spare buttons? Well, in case I lose one. Well, of course. Oh, good. Because the last suit I had made, I had spare buttons and I lost a buttonhole. <laughs> Look, sir, would you mind lifting your left arm a little higher? Now put your right arm out. Bend it. Drop your left shoulder. Lift your right one. Fit you like a glove. I wish it fit me like a suit. Yes, perhaps you are right. Well, relax for a moment, sir. I'll just bring the fitter. Right. It was a terrible night in the desert. <laughs> They were putting the camels to bed. One camel sat with his legs crossed, scratching the back of his head. <laughs> Do you like that? <laughs> hey? 
It's making you laugh a bit, isn't it? <laughs> eh? Look, I'm in rather a hurry, my good man. Do you have any blue material? Any what? Blue material. <laughs> well, I don't, I don't use it as, as a rule. But I'll tell you what, I did hear one the other day, funny enough. <laughs> it was about this big, tall Scotsman. And he met this little, tiny woman. And she said... Uh, that looks rather interesting up there. Oh, you've heard it? <laughs> That boat of cloth, could you get it down for me? So, yes, all right. This. <laughs> this, feel that. It's half nard and half wool. Really? Yeah, the sheep were fed on old plastic buckets. <laughs> <laughs> it's made you laugh a bit, isn't it? <laughs> yes, that's very good. Yes? Yes. Yeah. I'll have a suit in this. Really? Yes. Well, fancy that. <laughs> Well, aren't you going to take down my name and address? Uh, yes, all right. Well, will it take long to make it up? Uh, no, I don't think so, no. Uh, Charlie Farnsborn. <laughs> 37, Lesby Avenue. Chiswick W4. Well, who's he? I don't know. I just made it up. Look, are you or are you not going to sell me one of your suits? Certainly not. It would fit you. Uh, excuse me, uh, Mr. Cooper? No, no, that's Charlie Farnes. I'm Mr. Cooper. Uh, sir, could I be of assistance to you? Uh, oh, dear, oh, dear, oh, dear. <laughs> it's not one of mine, is it? No. No, it's not. not. I've been on holiday. <coughs> So, we'll soon get this right for you. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? Alterations, sir. This jacket makes, sir, look as if he's got fat shoulders. What, again? Oh, dear, they should never have let it get into this state before they checked the measurements. Well, now you mentioned this sleeve seems a bit longer, shorter than this one. Shorter, yes, yes. Never mind, we'll soon fix that for you, sir. <laughs> uh, it's a bit shorter now, isn't it? <laughs> Oh, my God, look at those lapels. <laughs> How's the other sleeve? Great. <laughs> yes, to you, perhaps, but not to the expert eye. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear, oh, dear, oh, dear, look at those pockets. <laughs> no, no, just, just a bit, just before we go any further, there's yes. something I've got to tell you. I know, I know, I know. It's the back seam, isn't it? Shoddy. Shoddy! All have to be done again. Mr. Hillbeam, a word. Just a minute, I haven't finished. Have oh, a look at these trousers. Oh, good Lord, just look at them. Yeah. <laughs> if you want to buy one of my suits, you can get this one cheap. <laughs> now, this leg, come on. Mr. Hillbeam, what is it? Hmm? Red sails in the sunset. <laughs> Wait, <what's it? laughs> I'll kill you for this. <laughs> Mr. Cooper, I, 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 I couldn't help you. It's not my fault. I, 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 I'll pay you the money for the suit. I've got any pockets to book it, have I? <laughs> anyway, I'm not going to get home. Well, look, there is one thing we can do, sir. If you'll just step into the cube. <laughs> Cavendish may need your well, I feel like a little more reference. How are we going to get me out of it? We're going to do it. We can't get you the hell, oh, oh, I just want to get his pity. Oh, what are you going to do with that pity? How am I going to get Hey, go on. Don't worry, sir. We'll run, run you. Yes. You'll run me on? Yes. All right, then you come on then. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> 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 